So hi and welcome, we're going to be playing The Long Dark. I'm going to be streaming at the same time here on Twitch. Uh, also YouTube and I think on the hitbox at the minute. So, let's see how we get on. Pilgrim, uh, one just quiet. I think we're going to play five up defeats. The new or inex or L experience players most interested in passive exploration. Well, we'll try Explosion Survival, we'll go for uh, Voyager. I've played a bit of uh, Pilgrim. Let's try Voyager. Uh, quite like Coastal Highway. Mystery Lake. Hmm. Pleasant Valley. Uh, let's go for Desolation Point. Not try this one yet. Could be a guy. I'm gonna call it Stream Bob. Let's get on with it. Is it food or? Edgy Bar. So you kind of, if you don't play this, you can uh, hold down space, you got your fat pack, shows what you've got, your temperatures outside or indoors, um, generally what you're wearing, so you've got a sleeping bag, we've got a woolen scarf which we're wearing, you can upgrade some of these clothing, some food to flare, sewing kit to repair stuff, um, obviously these are the tabs for more like refined, you can craft, um, it's a little bit dark, in the lighthouse, okay, and then we have to go through and try and find some goodies. Oops. I thought I'd do like a, I guess a few episodes on this. Let me know on the little YouTube, I'm going to put this to, let me know if you want me to uh, continue. So cloth allows us to repair clothes and the newspaper allows us to kind of repair, uh, to, to burn for like tinder. So the fire is, the fire is quite complicated here, you have to like tinder, fuel, stars, and you can use an accelerant like, like a lighter fluid or something like that, depending on what you want to use. Okay, that's uh, a little bit dark, so probably not the this best. Take a book, you can learn skills. Oh, I can't see Jack, maybe we should put flare on. Uh, so you can use this flare, you can have to light it. Now you get a chance of like, oops, of the ability to uh, start the fire or not. There we go. Now we can see what's going on. I like the looting system on this, pretty cool. We missed that book. These are just uh, good for burning. Last a bit longer. A lot of tinder around here. So we would have missed that medical supply. Use this. So in kit, use for repairing your clothes. You're like a percentage for repairing your leather boots and stuff. Gives you a better kind of protection in the cold. I'm not sure exactly what's happened. Uh, some soup. In terms of what's been going on in the world. We just lantern fuel, uh, or why we're here, but we've crash landed. You know, we crash landed on a plane. I'm pretty sure in Canada. I know that. I know that bit. You have to sleep to keep yourself asleep. Uh, that's a pretty good coat. You have to sleep to get yourself like your energy up and running. So uh, we can see here. This is a much better coat straight off the bat. So we can wear that coat. And uh, we can find the coat we did have, which I think is probably going to be not tick now. We can see the ticks. Oh no, okay. Still ticks. Uh, you have a cumbersome weight and push tab, you get these stats up on the left. Tells whether they were tired or not. As you get tired, you uh, can't carry as much goods. So I've got another flare good. Uh, metal. Okay, so if you get a hacksaw, you can break stuff down. And that allows you to. Oh, sweet. Um, allows you to uh, build like fish hooks and stuff. Um, Sample toolkit uh, allows us to give a better kind of like crafting ability. A ragged thin wool sweater. Now, the, like I said, the weather's a bit of a risk. We got to get some blizzards, and the wolves are a little bit of a problem. So, we've already got a better one. So, ah, uh, yeah. So what we can do with this one is we can break it down into, uh, harvest it into better cloth, but you lose time. So if you look at the top left, you can see uh, about 13 hours of daylight left. And obviously when it gets dark, it's a bit of a problem. It requires a pry bar, okay. It requires a hatchet. We get some reclaimed wood. Good, good. And the flame's going out. More reclaimable, good for making uh, 
plywood. <laughs> I'll probably drop that flare now. You'll see now I'll have a cross. There you go. Drop that. So I played probably about mm, three hours of it or something. The wolves do totally freak me out. Literally do not like it. Um, let's leave the lighthouse. So I'm a bit scared of the wolves. Now, let's see how we get on here. Give me a thumbs up on uh, YouTube once this goes on. Nice accelerant. Get the old flame going. If you want to see some more, I'll probably do another episode if you do, or a different map. Uh, and feel free to give me any tips uh, as usual. So we've got rifle bullets, uh, three of three rounds. Now, I have never found a gun. Um, but that looks like it's a bit nicer than an Enfield or something. Isn't that British 303? Now, this is where the problem lies, right? So you can't see anything, and neither can I. We can go down here. We'll get out of here. The hell was that? GTFO. Old creaky lighthouse. So you'd have a map, I don't think. Yep. You might be able to get one later on. Um I'm pretty sure you don't start with one. Let's see what's going on. Well, welcome to the outside world. Quite pretty. Canadian flag, so definitely in Canada. Now outside, you can see it's minus 13, conditions 100%, you do get blizzards. Um, so you're probably asking yourself, well, well what's the purpose of this game? The purpose of this game, if you haven't seen it already, it's been out since 2014, is purely to survive. That's it, in the wild. Um, I don't think you can build anything. You can craft a little bit. Um, yeah. And purely to survive. See, minus 19. We are a little bit hungry. Let's have a little bit of an energy bar. You do lose calories when you sleep, and you get kind of thirsty at the same point in time as well. Um, Ian got me into this. It was on sale on Steam. I think it was like 8 UK pounds, something like that. And uh, it's been on sale. It was released 2014. Been in alpha. Still in alpha at the minute. Which is good. So, um, I think we go right. The map is continuous. There's a card to search. Uh, it hasn't changed. It's always the same. I don't know if the actual items, I guess the loot changes, but I don't know if the actual, like, this car's always here or not. Um, I was going to push E to get inside. I don't know why. So we got a bit of a candy bar. Nice. Oh, I can still eat this. Some matches. Definitely handy for a fire. You can open the glove box. Pretty cool. Take a look at the back seat. Um, we'll probably go in the back. It gives a bit more heat. Stops us uh, freezing to death. Nothing else. So let's carry on as we were. Not too cold. Um, I think Ian's been playing it a bit. You know, MDE in the UK. And he's uh, he says he's had down to minus 57, but pretty much died. <laughs> Apologies, I don't have a bit of man flu. That time of year, innit? That hook. Um, so I have a little map up, so I don't know where I'm going. Let's have a look at that. I don't know what it is. Relish mushrooms, light edible mushrooms. Okay, I'll take that. I think Ian had shown me these before. He told me he had some mushrooms accidentally. I guess this is what he's always talking about. Mushrooms, baby. Right, let's see what's up here in this old cave. It was like a house actually further up looking at this. That's pretty cool. We'll go check this out. Um, I think if you run, you lose a bit more stamina. Um, I'm not sure you fight the wolves off. I know you can't, you can't get bitten by them. That's an old church. Yeah, okay. But it just freaked me out a little bit. Seems like it's a bit cold, a bit of dry mouth. That right, looks a bit derelict, a bit of newspaper. Okay, thank you. We need that layer, definitely. Definitely gonna need that. One candy bar. Okay, some wood matches, not bad, not bad. Uh, a bit more food. So we already got a sleeping bag, you start for one. Frontier shooting guide. Right, so you can read these books and some reclaimed firewood. You can also use these fire pits. 
So if we're a little bit desperate, we probably could sleep here. That first aid kit. I've never found one of them before. This stuff will come in handy. Antibiotics always good because you can get infected. A dead dude. All right. A first dead guy. Well, we definitely have hunting knife, which you can use to tear cloth with. And you can use that to repair your clothes. I don't think you can defend yourself with it. My fingers feel numb. Is that cold? Minus 11. I'm a bit nippy actually. Look, it's right, okay. So I'm a little bit cold. Um, so we better set this fire going for a little bit. So let's get this going. Probably burn a book. Accelerant. You can warm him up. Well, thank goodness for that. And hopefully it'll warm him up a little bit. Oh, his finger, why is his finger so numb? We don't need gloves on though, is that why? Hmm. We could do some gloves. Can we repair any clothing? Let's try and do that while we're here then. Um, right. Action. Repair. Use a sewing kit. Can't feel my feet. What? Oh my god. So what I didn't do there was like a noob. I, um... Oh shit, I didn't... Uh, <laughs> I didn't set my temperature right. Like in terms of like time it will burn, so I, cold in my life. I forgot to um Oh man. Yeah, I forgot to put enough wood on the fire to keep it going. I'm already dying at first at the minute. I'll quick look at this road. If not, I might come out to lighthouse today. Just wing it a bit. My headset. Have a look on this corner because it's a bit nippy. I don't just get hypothermia. There's a house. We're good. We're good. We're going to loot his house. Ten hours of daylight left. There's like a little town down here. Nice. Okay. Alright, we'll go down here. And a ship as well. Mm, okay. We're definitely looting this lot. I'm guessing I can just drop down here nicely. And he's tired. So you have to sleep. And you have to kind of time your days and nights together. I know what the 92% is condition. Right, okay. So I guess my condition is deteriorating. Um, normally you can find in the toilet some water. Um, I see we've got anything good in these boats on the first aid kit, is that? Okay. That's what we can find in this bad boy. Stim energy steroid injection will provide a short boost of energy. Right, okay, so when I'm tired, I can just stim myself. Right, okay, it works for me. You can't jump. Which I kind of find a bit weird. Um, let's go inside here and warm it up, I think. This looks like some kind of like exploration base. Hmm. Broken metal frame. There's lots of glue in it, but I could do warming up first. Not leave the trailer, damn it. I'm hoping there's a fire. It's a little bit warm in here, so maybe I'll warm up a bit. Reclaim wood. Yeah, these fingers are coming back gradually. Fishing tackle, you can fish, there's like fishing holes. Insulated vest, right, we're definitely putting that on. So, yeah, it's a little bit less than my, what was it going to wear instead of it? Instead of my Parker coat. So, what we can do is break this down. Hopefully, I'll warm up a little bit. His fingers are coming back a little bit. <sighs> then we can fix his Parker coat. And you get a kind of a like a chance to repair your coat. I'm getting thirsty though, which I've just realised. I don't think I've got any water on me. Oh, there we go. There we go, water. It's a little bit parched. Now you can fill up your water um, in the toilet. <laughs> it kind of works. Um, I guess the best bit is we can get like crowbars and all kinds of weird stuff to break stuff down, which we probably need. A place to make a fire, but you can't actually use a campfire, so. 
kind of works. Um, obviously, burning calories is all the bomb here. Uh, what's that? It's a normal bar, broken metal door. Can we put that? Now you hack so. Ooh, this where we were before. In this way. Then. <coughs> <coughs> oh, tender. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, manfully. Um, God damn it, man, manfully, man. Scrap metal. Um, it's probably used more for hooks and stuff. It's a bit tired, so. It was going to be under the ability to carry. Okay. I'll break pillars down. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm going to sleep in here. But you can put a sleeping bag down. Let's break some of these uh, pillows down. And then we'll go to bed. And then we'll use that cloth to repair our clothes in the morning. I don't think there's a skill advance system on this. Like you don't get more skilled. I could use well, this. you do. <clears throat> but. <coughs> yeah. Some beer will cure it. You get more skills, but um, like that book, I could read in a minute. We will read it in a minute. I kind of like this game. So a different twist to it. Ian was saying when I was talking to him, he says it's got, it's got a different twist, Bob. You know, it gives you uh, like surviving the elements rather than zombies, and I was like, mm, we'll see, we'll see. No, I do like it. He was right. Although, pained me to say it. Um, so, we've got a knife as well, which allows us to cut down things, but it does get blunt. So you can see 64%. You have to find a, um, a sharpening tool. I can't remember what the stone's called exactly, but you need that to uh, allow you to sharpen this. Look at that. Well, stone, look at that. I call it and it appears just like that. Just like that, man. So, we need to kip. He's getting a bit tired. Uh, it's only five hours night time, but... He went to sleep so fast. Let's have a kip. Um, I can't put it on a fire, but he's pretty semi warm. So let's just kip. Hopefully, we won't die. For, uh, probably a few calories, actually. Let's have some food. So you can die in your sleep. Go be a bit careful. I think I need to lay down. Yeah, you need to sleep, mate. Don't worry about it. We're going to put you to sleep. Keep your wig on. I know it's 35% of you, so that means it's rotten or something. Not worth that, are we? I assume it does. Uh, have some canned soup. Can open, obviously, because it's more beneficial than we found that. It'll allow us to eat a bit better. Have a bit of a kit. So we can get our uh, carrying ability back. We'll make sure we've got enough uh, food on us. And we're uh, filled up in water. Although we are getting a bit low. Yeah. I'm getting more water. We tried the last bit. So we've got to be careful there. Hopefully we won't thirst too much. I'll just burn calories, so 12 hours kip because we're um, going to try and sleep through most of the night if we can. Oh, that's the plan. So we're fully rested. Um, can't see a damn thing. Totally dehydrated. Not good. But I knew that might be the case. We need to light a flare. What the hell's that? A mushrooms. Don't rehydrate me though, does he? No, they don't. Um, so we need to get a flare on and probably try and find the next house because we loot this one up. Oh, we have to hold that left mouse button down to light these things. Cool. Wonder if this is mm -hmm. Oh, it will be. Oh, insulated boots. Right. Take them quick. Uh, these might be a bit better for us warmth wise. Yes, they are. Break these down. Mm. We're breaking down, we got a bit more time to get leather off boots, which is quite rare to be fair. I've not found much of it. Could end up being useful. Okay, more antibiotics and the uh, ooh, an epi, another epi pen. Probably break that down. I don't want flare to run out, that's why I'm being a little bit careful. Because if that runs out, we're in trouble. We'll have to start striking matches, which is just a total pain in the ass. So I'm hoping. Probably not my best idea. Oh boy. Um, I'm kind of hoping I can find somewhere else to loot. I need some water. 
don't know why I did that. That was a silly mistake, you see. Should have not done that. Go back inside for die. Wow. I'll die if I don't warm up soon. So I'm gonna start a campfire because I can't see a damn thing either. Uh, which I've never lit. Snow shelter, fire. Uh, well that sucks. So, we might have to play cards for a bit. Just to entertain ourselves. Let's pass. How many hours have we got? One hour left, maybe? Pass that. Hopefully, that'll. Daylight? If not, we're dead. Two hours of darkness left. Um, okay. So I've got to be careful here, as we're going to get some trolls. So, hopefully, it's warming up in here. Which was my main reason for coming in. Right. So. I need some water. Yeah, I need a drink. Don't worry about it. Do any of these rehydrate me? Oh, come on. Tomato soup surely does, yeah? Doesn't it? Tomato soup rehydrate you? I can see why crackers wouldn't, yeah? But. Tomato soup. It's pretty nice. I could actually do with a nice tin of tomato soup at the minute. Oh, look at that, there's a massive barn in front of me I couldn't even see because that freaking bad at night. So, we've got quite a lot to search here, but I desperately need some water, right? I can see I'm dehydrated. I'm probably going to die of thirst if I'm not careful here. Um, let's hopefully find something here, like a toilet, and then you can use that water. Need some it's so dark, man. I can't see anything. So I could strike a match, but I'm not going to. Um, oh, so oh, I can still eat this. Bingo. So here we go. Bit of thirst on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Touch the spot, baby. Touch the spot. Probably shouldn't eat stuff like that to dehydrate me. So gotta be a little bit careful. But kind of peaches. Can they rehydrate me? Probably not. Unfortunately, we should do because they've got like that sugary soup in. Yeah. I'm not short on uh, paper. So we're playing about mid level here. I'm playing the hardest level yet, and it's pretty damn tough anyway. This place is pretty damn ransacked. Um, might light a match here. It's because it. Uh, so light source match like these. Oops. A little bit of a look around. There we go. See another stone. Get our nice knife and sharp. Uh, what's that? Light fluid or lantern fuel? So you can light the little lantern to see what's going on. We haven't got one yet. These matches do not last long. Um, we do find the lantern. Like I say, feel free to give me any hints. Uh, pretty new to it. Not really played much. Kind of got an idea how it works. They used, yeah. That's a shame. Oh my lord. These are not lasting long at all. I'm hoping I can find something pretty good. Right, I've got a lot of cloth at the minute, but I'll use that later on. I don't want to use it now. I need something to drink. I think I can Ooh. use this. Down vest, very nice. Um, hunting rifle. Excellent. Boom. Never found a gun in my life. Shame we can't see. So, um, I don't even know how it works. Aim? I guess it's loaded. Yeah, okay. Um, so let's go for my. What can I do? Thirst or hunger? Hmm. I'm finding anything to drink. Alright, let's carry on. I just got a hunting rifle. There we go. There's something to drink. Thank God. I could do with a lot more water. Oh, that's right. We're going to put the uh, vest on. So it seems pretty good. Uh, it's going to knock it down a little bit. I think the coat's bare. Yeah. So we could probably break that down in a bit. 
Um, I'm going to need some form of light. Look at it, I can't, I can't see in here without any light. It's a bit of a pain. I don't know why. It's not as light in here. Oh, workbench, see? These are good, so you could, uh, you could build some stuff in here. I think I can use this. I can craft some stuff, maybe. So, I can light a fire in here and warm up a little bit. Maybe light the place up, do a bit of crafting. Cured leather, okay, thanks. Um, mm. I was hoping to have to light something in here, but that's not going to work. Let's carry on. Is this a burnable pit? Yes, fire pit. Right, okay, so let's burn. Yeah, burn a bit more wood, a bit more accelerant. This stuff seems to be pretty good. This should be pretty reliable for lighting the fire. Looks like it worked. I was hoping for a bit more light, I'll be honest. Loops are giving me no light, so that's not really help, but it'll warm me up, I guess. A safe. I've literally never found a safe. No idea how that's gonna work. Um. Okay, so if there's a key or combination or something. Let's have a little bit more of a look around. There seems to be a workbench near the minute. Ooh, cardboard box, more tinder. So you can roll out of bed. Um, what is my little bit of a concern at the minute? I haven't got much. I am scratching a little bit for it. So you're not short on no wood. Like I said, we've got plenty of wood, so let's keep this bad boy going at the minute. Uh, we'll probably burn some of this. Because we have tons, so oh. it seems to start pretty easy with accelerant. Maybe it's easier to start with a book. Right, okay. So Why didn't that work? A book, Tinder. Mm. You see, it takes a little bit of time to try and like get them going. So the accelerant obviously works quite a bit different. I want to say different. I mean, like it's a lot quicker to to get the fire going, as we saw. We'll see. So you get this like chance potential. If you get the fire going, you get this bonus. But I don't know, I kinda like this game. It's all worth the eight quid on Steam. I'm not sure it's eight pounds anymore. It was a week ago. Okay. So we're gonna put some reclaimed wood on this as well. Now point the ideal time. I just want to get nice and warm. Uh, it's lining up a little bit. Start to see a little bit more. We've got plenty of reclaimed wood, so not that first. There's a ton around there. Um, pallet. I'm hoping for something a little bit more extravagant. So maybe light up the torch here, and then later on we don't need to around the corner. But that just burns through the matches. Let me know in the comments if you're on YouTube wants to post this. The bearded Bob, you chob. Um, this is just all breakable crates, okay?